Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And uh, last time, Ash and friends just uh, warped back and found we found ourselves in the middle of a fight with uh, this Motley crew. Now, well, I guess you're done then. Yeah, next turn you'll push that walk across and get the treasure. And hopefully not die to a bunch of things. No one's even in line with that. Okay. That's great, Diego. Can you be more ineffective? Yes. Yes, you can. Yeah, you, you can be more ineffective. Seriously, what is your deal? Can you shoot anybody this... No, no, you can't. Uh, I guess we are just going to snipe people from this direction. And... Just come over here and be like the green guardsman. And Clive, you can just do whatever you want. Uh, okay, if you come over here and you try and do a phase shift, you can hit three people. Question is, are they worth hitting right now? Oh, those guys are going to be annoying. Yeah, we gotta kill those grenades, and... Yeah, grenades can do whatever they want, but uh, we gotta make sure... All those bats are gonna be annoying, so... Really, the question is, how far can these guys move? They can move up there so they can hit the hair. Uh... I guess we're just going to create a blockade here. I know the enemy is... These guys are not dumb enough to fall into that trap anymore. I don't even know what treasures are worth getting. I never know that, so what difference does it make? Uh, enemy turn. I believe we do have to eliminate all of the enemies here. Oh good, you're leaving Huxley alone. Oh good, you get right in line with the boulder. Oh, those guys are dumb enough to move in. Well, I'm not going to complain, I'm just going to phase shift them all away. Now the danger in doing that sort of phase shifting um, with our mages is that you could be denying your other characters some valuable experience. Oh, get out of here with that. No, no, not paralyzed. Oh, you... But on this particular map, we have a ton of enemies. We need all the help we can get. Okay. We need Grog to have a turn. Holy lightning. Oh, it only hits one target. We'll have to do that later. Um, Grog. I was kind of hoping they'd poison instead of paralyze. Well, we can't move you up, but uh, if we phase shift, we got four of you in there. Yeah, I'm going to say that's good enough, because we got to get some stuff dead here. 
You might even try Ash's rolling fire. Yeah, look at that. Go Zohar. Okay. How much magic does this take? It takes eight magic? Well, you'll kill that, uh, yeah, we'll kill the things that matter. Because otherwise we're not getting to that, uh, grenade or... Oh, wow, they just kind of, like, burn to a crisp there. They're all ignited and glowy. I like it. Grog, fix the bat. Yeah, Grog, you're up to bat. <laughs> oh, that was also terrible. Grog should hopefully survive. Okay, now to deal with everything else that's going on. Huxley. Yeah, go get that treasure. Mega herb. Hmm, okay. Uh, Delon, hold that. Why would the bat turn its back on us? Just make my life easy, would you? And Diego now has nothing else to do, unfortunately. Because all the enemies decide to congregate at uh, Ash's side. Oh, I guess Diego can't even go for that treasure. We're going to have to send... Well, we'll send one of those two after it. We might send Zohar after it because he's going to be low on magic after this. Okay. Yeah, maybe that was a waste. But it will let me take out this bat and not have to worry about getting paralyzed. So I consider that a pretty good idea. The other thing that might not have been a good idea was moving Grog up. Yeah, this is turning into a bad idea. He can take maybe two more attacks. Oh, you want some of this? <laughs> Go to lot. Oh my goodness. Axe Smash Fever. Oh, Grog might be dead here. Well, I mean, not on this particular attack, but... All because we had to heal him, but we've got another Grenader here. That's gonna target Grog. Block this, please. Ah, oh, that was rough. It's because that bat had to paralyze him. I mean, if I opted to heal instead of fix that, the bat would have still been alive. Um, how daring are we? Let's let's see how the rest of this goes. Um, yeah, Diego, work your way around here. on finish him off or fail miserably I mean that's an option we gotta get these grenaders out of here I don't want to trigger him yet either um Let's be risky. <laughs> oh, yes, it paid off. That, by all rights, that should not be how this game works. 
Um, I want those grenaders dead. Roman fire? Hey, I have three uses of that. Okay, well, let's see what Roman fire does. Our sorcerer is getting all sorts of new spells. Oh my. Okay, Roman fire, a bit easier on the MP. Here, Ash, you get in here and roll them over. This might not be the greatest for trying to get a whole bunch of different experience from these guys, but uh, experience will kind of balance out as characters take actions. You know, when we're level 16, we're going to get less experience than than if we were uh, level 14 here. I think everyone had a turn, yeah? Yeah, 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 everyone had a turn. Clive, do you plan on, you know, doing anything? Ever? Delon, do you plan on hitting this guy? He's taking you down to 48 health. All because you missed. Well, that's useful. That's not nice. Really? Oh, that's a warlock. Rainbow stroke. Oh, no. I... That's almost like a stroke of genius. Zoot! Zoot is moving! Oh, I'm not ready for you to move. I'm not going to get the rest of the treasure on here. Do I even care? Why do I care about this? Oh, you're taking Diego's spot. Okay, so Sarah... We gotta heal up. And I wish we still had Grog. Can you reach... No, you can't. What else am I supposed to do here? Uh, I guess Huxley needs to do something. Yay, you were useful. Uh... Yeah, we'll do more Roman fire. That is a cool spell indeed. Okay, we got that guy down. But now Zoot is going to just... Zoot and that Warlock are just going to do kind of whatever they want. I don't think that Deacon's ever going to do anything. Oh, you're still targeting... Uh... Okay, that's fine. As long as Zoot doesn't attack him. I don't think that Deacon's going to do anything until uh, one of his guys are injured. Oh, that actually wasn't bad. Okay, cool. My Nash is getting another level out of this. Uh, Clive, I'd say good job, but it's not. Diego is just 
kind of not in this at all. Okay. This guy... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, Delon... Actually... That deacon's not gonna actually do anything, so... I want to make sure Delon gets the kill here. He could use the experience more than Ash. And if Grog is all I lose on this battle, that's fine. Because guess what? I remember uh, when my dad and I played this, mainly he played and I watched, uh, he got a game over on this map. Okay, but... Uh, yeah, Ash, I'm gonna send you to go get that treasure. You, you don't have any magic. It's fine. I could... I could paralyze that guy. Which wouldn't be the most awful idea I've ever had. But paralyzing him down there, oh. I guess it gives Diego time. We've got time anyways to kill. Well, that's just unfortunate. And you're over here with just tons of magic. Okay, we'll kill that guy next turn. I know what we'll do. We'll let Diego kill the deacon that's just kind of been dancing there the whole time. You're targeting Sarah now. That is a really nasty spot. They must have, when they designed this map, they made it so that uh, that guy could just kind of hang out there. Oh, Clive, don't you even get involved. I don't want you taking my... Oh, he's going to take my kill. Clive can get right in the way. Um, I guess... For the sake of getting Huxley some experience, since he did take a couple turns to get, uh, treasures... There, we got him up to 15. Okay, now to deal with this dumb guy. Uh, Holy Lightning. Let's see what... Fine. Let's move in. Holy Lightning. Oh my goodness. These... <laughs> graphical effects. That was pathetic. I guess just and we'll just keep doing that. So he's probably pretty resistant to magic since he is a mage himself. Yeah, Diego, we need you over here. Oh, you can't get here faster. Very well. Oh, now you're going to move. Oh, 
Oh, that deacon is moving. Oh, Clive, don't you start. You're in my way. Oh, good. We have just enough to uh, get the an elixir. All that hassle for an elixir. Okay. Well, now you guys can die. Starting with you. Um, it's not quite how I expected things to go. Uh, well, Huxley, you can heal some people. Lock off this guy's exit here. <laughs> oh, that was great. I do kind of want Diego to get the kill on this. That's, that's not going to happen, is it? Diego, this is just not your day. Uh, Zohar... Rather you get the experience than uh, Clive. Yeah, only losing Grog. Could have been much worse. And now for our post-battle cutscene and catching up. Yeah, Clive does not join our party. Past three years. Oh my. Well, that would have been even worse. Hey, that annoying boulder that was by that treasure came back. Okay, so we're missing Eleni. Not sure how Eleni and Huxley ended up separated. And we're missing Clint. Uh, Emperor Hell, great. Yeah, that kind of becomes a problem. Oh yeah, that's an idea. Th that's one way of doing it. Oh, getting into there is going to be... Well, it's not going to be easy. But it's going to be necessary. Oh, that's where Clint, Eleni, and Amon. Yeah.
Yeah, we just kind of drop into uh, the middle of a fight and um, just happens to work out well. Oh, we're already... Well, let's go shopping. We've got time, plus the last video was kind of light. Nothing new, huh? I don't think it's really going to matter. Ooh. Mega Herb restores many HP. Well, that's just wonderful. Uh, although, speaking of items, you may be wondering why I gave uh, some items to some specific people before we had this huge split. And, well, it wasn't for any of the battles that we've had so far. It's for, well, Clint, Elaney, and Amon, apparently. Do I have Amon with a useful item? I don't think I do. I think I misremembered. I thought Diego would have been captured. Okay. Well, oh, let's check out the tavern. Talk to these people. Before Emperor Hell came to power, people thought the royalists were behind the terrorist attacks. Hmm. How about that? Well, that's not usually strange for them if they want to maintain power. Oh, they're looking for more power, more magic stones, or whatever. Yeah, we kind of ran into Zoot again. Ooh, we're going to have to fight the Crimson Guards, too. That's going to be a really difficult battle. Five Crimson Generals? Well, we're going to be fighting them as well. But we'll deal with all of that next time.